Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Time. I'm Thomas coming to you live from a really pretty vineyard here in South Napa. I wanted to cover a topic that I get quite a bit of inquiry on, which is uh, how do I obtain my first level sommelier or how do I uh, prepare to pass the first level or introductory level of the Court of Master Sommeliers? Where do I get started? And um, I would basically tell you that the introductory level is kind of neat because you spend a couple days uh, studying together with a big group and with the, the master sommeliers and there's people around you teaching you about wine and it's kind of like a course so they're preparing you to take this introductory exam should you come into the exam with a little bit of base knowledge of course you should you should come in having maybe read through a few different wine books one which I certainly recommend is Karen McNeil's wine Bible I remember when I was a young sommelier I read that thing cover to cover it's a real easy read it's not just like an encyclopedia um, with droning on about wine laws. It actually has a lot of um, fluid topics about wine regions and history, and it's very easy to read. So I would definitely recommend Karen McNeil's Wine Bible. Um, but come into the exam with basic knowledge of the different wine regions in the world, uh, Bordeaux, Burgundy, Champagne, France, and which grapes grow in each region. Uh, a little bit of the background on the, the laws of each region. Um, Come in with knowledge about Italy, Spain, Germany, the old world wine regions and uh, some of the laws and grape varieties grown in each. Be familiar with the New Worlds, Napa Valley, Sonoma County, uh, Willamette Valley, uh, the regions up in Washington State and uh, come in with a little knowledge maybe about Australia and South Africa. But um, it's not an exam that's so intensive that you need years and years and years of study and as I mentioned there's a course that you're um, going through with the master sommeliers where you taste together with them where you talk about the different regions and in the actual course itself you do become quite prepared they also have a little manual that you're gonna wanna study quite a bit once you get that and be prepared to take the exam it's a multiple of choice exam um, it's a theory exam you're not going to be blind tasting in the introductory course with the, the court of master sommeliers and it's really a, a, a level that's designed to get you ready to eventually take your certified sommelier, which is a lot more intensive. I would say uh, don't freak out about the, the introductory course. Go in with being prepared and having some background knowledge about wine. But um, as long as you pay attention and study diligently the manual and listen to the class and take the instruction from the master sommeliers, you should be able to pass this multiple choice exam with the percentage, I think it might be, I don't know if it's 75, 80% um, that you need to pass on the exam to, to uh, get, get your first level. But um, I, I would say those are some of the tips that I would have uh, for you when um, deciding to take the first level uh, exam. Anyways, if there's any questions about the topic, leave them in the comments below. I'll certainly get back to you. And um, thanks so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel.